we are so excited to be back at this original little yeah. church where we really first started. And over to the side here, there's a dirt parking lot where we used to pack in the cars, mm -hmm. rain or shine. And then behind us is the little white church that we've talked about often where we just would pack in the people Sunday after Sunday. Um, we just kind of wanted to bring you back here and show you the roots of the beginning of yeah. Dwelling Place Family Church. 40 years ago. And so we're starting a series for the month of December and we're starting in this series about family matters. Family matters. Not only matters of the family, but family matters. And so in this series, we're gonna teach and show you how, even if you're a single individual, you don't have family with you, or you're not living in a family currently, that you can feel plugged in, you can understand family, and you can walk in the blessing of family. And believe me, you're gonna be surprised at some of the things that are gonna come out about this series and how God yeah. uses the family. So everything started with here. You can, um, you can see here that even small beginnings, even in your own life, can grow into great things. And, and families are supposed to grow. Even if you're a family Absolutely. of one at our church, plug in, grow, family of two, family of 10, it doesn't matter, church family's family. And that's kind of where we want to go. And we with started out here, the first yeah. service was like, what, 10 cars? Yeah. You know, yeah. 10 cars, and now look what it's grown to. And that's because that's God's plan. He blesses people, and people grow through families. Behind you, you can see windows where people stood on the outside, windows would be open. We, we have stories of things that went on the inside, you know. Well, we used to have a big cattle feeding trough that we used for water, for baptism, right at the side, and we'd pull up a trailer and stuff all the kids in there. I remember once um, a couple wanted to get married here, and so Bob handed in the keys to the church, did the wedding, <laughs> yeah. and left on a Saturday night. And I get a phone call on a Sunday morning. Well, they brought all the beer out after <laughs> Bob left, and the place was trash. It's well, the alcohol beer. melted the wax yeah. on the floor. So he and put their cigarette butts out on the floor. It was bad. So here we are, ready, ready for Sunday morning, and that's kind of. But a lot of things. It was yeah. it was just a great. Uh, and then you'd have your motorcycle, remember? Oh yeah. We only had one car, yeah. and so I'd bring the kids in the car, and Bob would drive his I'd little motorcycle. Right off in the motorcycle with the offering bag strapped to the back of the motorcycle, and our prayer time before the service. There were two little bathrooms. We had to go into the bathroom to have prayer. So, and then you know, they the God toilet. blessed us. Five of them would walk out. And so family matters. Family makes a difference and it's how you grow. It's how we all grow. So come along with us in this series and let's see what God has for us to get us ready for 2015. Amen. All right, come along with us. Thanks for being here. All right, now we want to show you one more thing. 40 years ago plus, somebody just happened to snap this picture of our family. Here's Bob and I and Sharon and Suzanne. You can see Suzanne is just a baby and we're holding her. So we've kind of kept that picture all these years. Now, I want to show you something else going to blow you away. The two most adorable, cute grandkids you've ever seen in your life. Here's Sierra and here's Cheyenne in the very same spot, uh, you know, a little older actually than Suzanne and, and Sharon were, but in the very same spot back at this church. But this is how families grow and go around. That's These right. are our grandkids, this for pity's sake. Issue. Yeah, so this is what we're talking about, just growing as a family, growing as a church family. And the lineage and the heritage of a family, that's important. And so in this series, we're gonna talk about family matters. The matters of family, but family also matters. How can we bring longevity into the message and the vision and of the dwelling place? into your family. And into your family. So come along with us in the series. Thanks for being here.